Welcome back to Inside the War Room. <laughs> we are recapping week number five. Oh, another week about to be in the books. Bang, baby. What do we think about this week as a whole? It's Good a, week. Good the week. one o'clock games were freaking sick. There is so much going on. And the nine thirty a.m. games this week were that amazing, dude. dude. Something for the six people that watched it. <laughs> Matt Crosby, you five son of a gun, miss or Mason, uh, Mason, Mason Crosby, Crosby, whatever his name is. What? You suck. Is Wait, that a record? What's that? What? Five missed field goals no, straight. They not. showed a stat. It <laughs> in wasn't. one game. No, was it, it was four in a row, wasn't it? Yeah, but it was five total. If I was a I Packers was. fan or a Bengals fan, I would have been losing my mind. But that was some of the most fun I've ever. I know it was you hilarious. Were kind of nervous. Yeah, I, was, I had a big bet game. on the line. I won, thank God. But wow, that was hilarious. That was that amazing, was awesome. dude. I it was, was enjoying all of that. I wanted them to just keep kicking field goals and yeah. just missing. I was like, all right, you miss now, you miss now, you miss. It was crazy. Now you do it again, you miss. <laughs> dude, at the end of the game, Aaron Rodgers said, "Oh yeah, we knew he was gonna have it. I knew he was getting Bull. that one." Dude, they lose that game. Aaron Rodgers is like, Bull. get us a new kicker. You know, a lot <laughs> of fun. Now no, they're bad. probably boys because they've been on the team together yeah. for a long time. But like, shoot, though, man. Yeah. Yeah, he says it like it is, though. Oh, uh, I cannot imagine. That's the one thing. If you're a kicker, man, and you're in that situation that many times, I could not imagine the I feeling. Said, it's like one thing that. to miss one, like yeah. one in field goal, but to miss like three. Well, in one game. Like, it gets in your mind. So, like, you yeah. kick that first one, you miss it. You're like, all right, next try. Next one goes the same way, and it's like, oh, crap. Am yeah. I just like, how am I kicking these? Right. Like, The biggest meme was the Bengals kicker that might have went through. Like celebrate. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that, oh, I forgot about way. that. That was oh, so bad. Man. Well, the people, he was celebrating, but so were his teammates. I don't know. Like, yeah. Did anybody not, like, actually look at the play? I'll like, tell you what, the, the Bengals, they look They put good. up some numbers. Uh, they look, they did. Dude, the Bengals are pretty promising. I mean, Which... Then again, the Packers are like, what are you doing? Jamar Chase is something he's else. He's on, animal, man. he's on the tracks, bro. Yeah. Mm-hmm. He's the Ronte Adams, though. Dog, 200 yard game. Oh, man. That's crazy. Just Aaron Jones? What's him. going on with Aaron Jones? So are they trying to split evenly between Dylan and Jones now? I like, think that's what? a new thing in the NFL where if a team yeah. has two good running backs, they're just going to use both Which, of them. But they use Dylan. Though. They used him a lot this game. I know. And they, and they have Jones. done that before. I didn't hear Aaron Jones' name pretty much. Did he had Dylan? a big run, but like. Yeah. Man. Dylan was more effective. Which I think it's so smart. With the lifespans of mm-hmm. like running backs in the leagues, like, you know, to to save your running back as much as you can is is genius. Yeah. I don't know. The Packers just oh, they could lose any game. Right. The oh, thing about Dylan and Jones, they're two different type of players. Dylan's the big guy that's gonna yeah. run three up the pipe and try to bowl people over, and then Aaron Jones, you're a looser yeah. guy, he'll get the receptions and whatnot. But yeah. I mean Dylan was getting catches too. So Talking about, you know, some funny things going on with the kickers and stuff. Yeah, boy. Uh, some funny things going on with the Detroit Lions. Yeah, boy. Uh, <laughs> they practically had the game won in, in Detroit-like fashion. <laughs> Again. Oh, <thanks. laughs> Again. They allowed Minnesota, of all teams, to Minnesota. go and kick a field goal and ended up losing the game. All this is going on at one time, mind you. We have How? three TVs going. And Thank especially because, <laughs> min- dude, it's like, okay, it's Minnesota. They're going to miss How? this field goal because Minnesota just does stuff. Look at Arizona. Time. They should have won that game and they missed a field goal. Dude, I had Minnesota as my survivor pool pick this week. So, yeah. I did once Detroit goes Listen. for two, it's, it's over, it, right? Yes. It's over. There's like 30 yes. seconds left. Nope. What the <laughs> heck? Nope. And then uh oh, man. Patriots and Houston. Houston. Yeah. Another close one. <laughs> what games this week actually, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Very interesting. Yeah, I'm not surprised. Well, okay, I'm a little bit surprised, but I wasn't super surprised that Houston was able to keep that game close. You're not. I'm not. I'm not too surprised. So, are you a believer in the Texans, no, or are you a not no. believer in the I'm Patriots? I'm a not believer in the Patriots. They wow. had their one good game versus the Buccaneers, which they still lost. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The Patriots aren't going anywhere. I agree. No, we're we're I not. fully agree. Fine. Yeah, it's not that they're not right now. I fully agree. Not but yeah, that ended up being a good game. I can't believe yeah. the Patriots ended up pulling that out of their hat oh, and winning that game. Yep. I know. Then we, yeah. Pretty much the best game, Cleveland. Cleveland in the Chargers. What yeah, a, what, what a shootout! Nine. What a points. shootout! Is that what it ended up being? Eighty-nine combined points. Yeah, I think a thousand fifty-two combined yards, fifty-two first downs, and I think yeah. twelve touchdowns. Fifty-two or first downs. <laughs> well, freaking our over/under video. <laughs> mine was over/under one hundred fifty-five total rushing yards between Chubb and Hunt, and Chubb did it along with one hundred sixty-six yards. <laughs> <laughs> so that was insane. <laughs> I like the Chargers a lot right now. Yeah, Man, I know. That's I why am, I said that last I week. I was like, they're slowly starting to become my like kind of favorite almost. But then the I Bills know. had a crazy game against the Chiefs right now. So yeah, but man, the Chargers yeah. are good. 
Yeah. I don't want to jump past the Browns because I was so impressed with the Browns without Jarvis Landry, even though they lost the game. They were still yeah. able to score points, yeah. and that showed well, me a lot that I could still have them as one of my top teams. Is it pretty much confirmed, though, that you put up that many yards and points and OBJ had two catches for 20 yards? And he dropped the wide open one, too. It just... He's, he's it's it. It's over. Look, we like, talked about uh, it briefly before. He he mentioned that he's had this ongoing injury for the past 10 years. Supposed excuse. to get surgery. Doesn't want to get... Excuse. Su- what does it sound like to you, Joe? Excuse. What does that sound like to you, TJ? Excuse. It sounds like an excuse to me. I think it's it for him. Yeah. He's like I Njuku agree. had like... He had like over 100 yards. He was like the okay. leading receiver. Well, that, he yeah. had that one super deep one. Like, yeah. What the, the most sorry tackle attempt I may have yeah, ever seen. Was, he took yeah. his it flaccid was, body. It was bad. He, he just threw himself at him. Yeah. Like, are you kidding me? I think he thought he was maybe going to have like a big hit doing that. And it's just, I hate that man. I mean, like backfired. <laughs> like, yeah, like you, you look so embarrassing if you do stuff mm-hmm. like that. Yeah, man. that was bad. But. The Bears got a big win against the Raiders today. They did. Okay, yeah. Twenty to nine. Oh, I, wait a I was big. Oh. On, like I said when the season was starting, I'm like, yeah, I like the Raiders. And now, yeah, it's finally it's, every bro. year finally. They, they do seem like they can win some good games, but they just. Yeah. They're not considered. They can't saying, like dog. get over the hump. They're just. They are what we said at the very beginning, though. They're just that average yeah. team. Yeah. Just kind of you want to you want to admit that too, TJ? No. Dude, they got. You don't want to admit it yet. What? That they're just like an, a meh average team. No, because the they Raiders? have the weapons, and it's just yeah, amazing. but they can't. They, they can't know. execute. Bro, man. And their car got hurt. I don't know what his status Henry is. Henry Ruggs, but how are you say meh, average. Renfro, or what? How do you say his name? Renfro, sure. Jacob. No, he is not average. Compared to the compared to the top three receivers on any NFL roster, they're in the bottom half. No Waller, doubt. especially in their Waller's Derek the best. Carr, the Waller's Josh Jacobs, the best yeah. Josh Jacobs, who have like a thousand yard year, but like he's, he never like breaks out. Yeah. He's not the difference maker in like any game. Their defense is good too. Yeah, I mean their defense is they good. Ha- yeah. They have a good team, and their that's offense why got skunked back to back weeks. And I'm freaking disappointed, Raiders. What the heck? Yeah, what did Derek you Carr, do? Derek Carr is not the guy, though. I, Derek Carr is the guy, <sighs> though. He is. He's, he's been doing it for so long. It's been the same average. story. Every, ever since yeah. his MVP season, it's yeah. just been meh. It's yeah. been injuries and meh. Mm-hmm. That's all it's been. Yeah. I don't know. Raiders are average. I, I'll tell you what. Bro, incoming Cam Newton. I'm, I'm just getting some vibes. <laughs> incoming Cam Newton. Yeah. <laughs> Listen, nah, this, why not? The know. segues keep coming in. Talking about MVPs. How about the Cardinals versus the 49ers? <laughs> low, low scoring, scoring though. Low yes. scoring. I didn't even really see that coming, though. That was I pretty That was a battle. I was impressed by the 49ers. Yeah. With Trey, Trey Lance. Lance. I was impressed yeah, by Trey him. Lance not gonna is lie. mobile. Oh, he is a runner. He's still figuring yep. it out, though. Like I said, it was oh, his yeah. first start. You could tell, Which, like, there's some Knicks in there, but, like, hey. He's, give him time. I have yeah, to say, I have to he's say gonna something be, real quick. Trey yep. Lance. He's a runner. He's a track star. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that's it. Okay. Right, that didn't happen. <laughs> anyway. So you've been preaching the story about Trey Lance. Are you oh, happy let's be honest. First official start. He, he did all right. I mean, they didn't have any points in the first half, yeah. I don't think. It was low scoring all around. It was low though, scoring I mean. all around, but he did show quite a bit. Who scored for them? Is it Debo Samuel? Is, that, is he mm, the one that scored? Uh, I don't even know. But I think so, yeah. Was it? He had I that one so. crazy. He had a sick yeah. catch. It was, yeah. I, I was impressed. Was I was more impressed by their defense. Trey Lance did not. I don't think he had any turnovers. He, I don't, he threw a pick. I yeah, thought. I think he did. did, did he did yeah, threw a pick. I'm pretty sure. He had a I don't pick. think I see in the beginning That's of the game. Yeah. But I, all in all, he did all right. It wasn't. It's stati- his first. Like I say, it's his first. Yeah, start. Debo There's, Samuel did have the one touchdown. Let me see. Statistically, he didn't have the greatest game you ever see. But we He'll seen, figure it out. We seen. We seen it definitely. They, their offense plays a lot different with him in. I mean, all oh, the yeah, different sure. extra stuff that yeah. they could do. The way that the defense is going to have to try to cover him. Mm-hmm. Still no George Kittle though. Yeah, he's out for yeah. at least a few he's weeks been, on IR. He's yeah. another injury guy. Yeah, he now, hasn't man. been. He wasn't even that big of a factor when he was healthy right? this season, though. Well, yeah. I mean, we're seeing it. Saquon Barkley, injury prone. Oh, again. that one's bad, Kittle, dude. injury prone. Kenny Galladay, yeah. again, not that big of a right. guy right now, but he got hurt again today. Right. And then, I mean, Dalvin Cook didn't play. We've seen it. Injury prone. Has been. Injuries, yeah. McCaffrey, McCaffrey, that was last week. Been injury prone. It's kind of Did you say actually. Saquon? I don't know Saquon, Saquon, yeah. yeah. Okay. It's yeah. Like depressing. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it actually, is. Though. It is. Right. I mean, just for like fantasy purposes, it's just like are do you like seeing these guys play and like be explosive? Because yeah. these guys are so exciting to watch. Like these are some of the best players. Like honestly. if Dalvin Cook was healthy, like so exciting, they'd have better games. Like I feel like yeah, they I could, he's kind yeah. of the difference yeah. in them losing right now. But shout out to Madison though because he's done good. He did have hundred yards today. He is doing Damn. well. Yeah. Shout out Chubba Hubbard. Chubba. 
But he put up today. He put up today. How about we talk about that Eagles Panthers game? What happened? We don't always. My Eagles, who I said were going to be trashed this year. Your Eagles. You don't even like the Eagles. (laughs) Picked them though, huh? (laughs) Yeah. And they did it. They got the comeback win. I think the Panthers more or less just choked it. Yeah, I was going to say the Panthers lost that game. Are you starting to get nervous? I wouldn't say that word. No. Because you can't even really talk about their receiving core anymore no. because it's pretty Dude. much DJ Moore and nobody yeah, else. Robbie Anderson, not he's yeah, not doing anything. Yeah, he did not have a good game at all. Oh, he, he was all year. Really he was flaming on the sidelines at the end of the game, too. I don't was know what he, he was like happened. yelling at. I was like, I don't know if it was the offensive coordinator or one of them. It might have been at Sam. No, he, at one point, but he was definitely yelling at a coach. I seen. Oh, he <laughs> was so mad. Dude. But Chuba Hubbard, I, or Chuba Hubbard, Chuba. whatever he's saying. Oh, the announcer was Canadian. saying his name. Chuba Hubbard, I swear to you, he was. He had a game. Like, he looked like he could be he's a starting running back out there. being a rookie, he's good. Yeah, mm-hmm. he's nice, but would but you, I mean, let, he's no Christian McCaffrey. Well, let's no, be real. Of not. Like, mm-hmm. <laughs> Uh, Devonta oh, Smith is look has been looking pretty good, the rookie yeah. for the Eagles. Yeah, he, mm-hmm. he was the leading reception guy for them. So. What do you guys think of Jalen Hurts? He's growing Not on good. me a little bit. Yeah, is he? He is. You don't like I was him. very down on him. No good. He's not the guy right now to me though. That's like he could have real good games, but then he could have really bad. Games. Like he's just the inconsistent guy. Yeah. But again, he's new. He could grow. He could get better. But right now, I just I don't, thought I don't their know offense that. was going to be horrendous this year, and they showed they can put up points if they have to. Yeah. And they, I mean, they pretty much done it almost every they week. Minus the forty nine. I mean, they were putting up some points against Kansas City. Obviously, they lost that game. Mm-hmm. I feel right. Like the Chiefs were in. If Jalen Hurts was good, the Eagles would have won that game much more cleanly. I don't know about that because and I don't think the Eagles have a good team. No, I don't think they do, but I think Jalen Hurts not being the best doesn't help him at all. And I think their tight end, Goder, how, or however you say it, Goddard. he Goddard, is yeah. bad. bad. And not in the good way. Oh, wait, I've seen that man drop at least two passes. Just he did have a bad open. game today. He did oh, have a bad game Oh, but he's today. had a bad game before, too, because I put him in my lineup one week. <laughs> <and buddy. laughs> That's why. So you have a personal right. bad <laughs> Slow down. down. I, Slow down. Say, I don't know if he's as bad as you're, you're saying Oh, uh, I don't know. Every time I see that man... Mm-mm. Mm-mm. I'm gonna have to strongly too, disagree, too and I'm gonna have to say he's a top ten tight end in the oh, NFL. Oh wow, that doesn't say much. I mean, with tight yeah. ends, but <laughs> it doesn't. But it, I mean, I th- I'd say I'd feel pretty strong about it. I'm not what, gonna say top five. What's your top ten tight ends in the league? That's right what now? I'm saying. <laughs> That's <laughs> you, want that, that, you want me to go no, down the list? Because yeah. I will make one up right now. We'll do that after. <laughs> I'll make one up right now. I yeah, swear. Nobody wants to listen to that. So, uh, shout out game. Eagles getting yeah. that dub. What else do we got here? Steelers, yeah. Falcons, oh, yeah, Steelers. we talked about it. But we yeah, about which, again, it, we'll kind of vaguely go over them. But yeah, we check had a whole video on it. two videos on both of them. So, check out those on the no, channel. Steelers but overall promising. Najee Harris finally had a decent game. Yeah. A good mm-hmm. game. He had a very good game. Over yeah. 120 yards, yeah. five yards of carry. Offensive yeah. line, promising. Not to me, yeah. holding calls. Very nice. Yeah. But, so, hey, Seattle banged up some momentum. Yep. Let's carry into yep. it. Yep. And speaking of... Top ten tight ends in the league. You know, Kyle Pitts got his first touchdown. Oh, I don't game. know if he was going to make the list. And, yet, uh, <laughs> confidence booster. Confidence England, booster for him. So I'm excited for that. Matt Ryan looked good. We had uh, no sacks on the day, which was nice. Off, Matt Ryan didn't get sacked, which was nice. So I'm, I'm excited going in against you know Jacoby Brissett and hopefully uh, and a little bit beat up Miami Dolphins team. So mm-hmm. hopefully we could get those two wins that I was expecting. Uh, we also had the Cowboys and Giants. The score ended up pretty ugly, 44-20 yeah. to 20 Cowboys. Yeah. The game really Saquon. wasn't close. The Giants had so many injuries. Yeah, they were yeah. bad. Yeah. It, it, that was nah, so – Cowboys – Everybody went down. Cowboys are good. Yeah. Yeah. Mainly the thing that shocks me is their defense. Their defense is pretty good. Mm-hmm. And Zeke Which looked good out there too today. Zeke had a really good game, I think actually. Especially for he's being like – I don't know how banged up he was coming into the game. Yeah. But mm-hmm. right? he's he been, very good. He has he's, been like three consistent weeks now. Yeah. Yeah. It's very good. Saquon, unfortunately, hopefully he's doing well, but his ankle, you just it seen it. His ankle it got swollen. I think it's on Instagram. Yes. Huge. His ankle got I didn't really want to look at it. It's huge. It's huge. Yeah. Well, it wasn't like gruesome to look at, but man, like it just swelled it's up big. immediately. It's a balloon. Like it's like, oh, that can't be good. And it's the same. All the Giants fans know it's the same story every yeah. single year because the injury problems on their offense. It just happens time and yeah. time again. Mm-hmm. Yeah. What is up with that? And what do you do? You can't do anything. Exactly. Yeah. Like, it, is it anybody's fault? Is it just terrible luck? Yeah. That's like, why I wanted. I wanted to Saquon talk Barkley. about like <laughs> these players that seem to get injured over and over again. The are they players. just more susceptible, or is it just really bad luck? What is it? 
They have. Are to they be. playing? Is it somebody like Saquon Barkley playing like well, that's the thing. so much tougher well, than everybody else, where he puts himself in those bad situations? No, well, it's how much that how many carries and targets he get? It's the same people: Dalvin Cook, yep. Christian McCaffrey, Saquon. That's why the running backs are workhorses. Yeah, yeah, they touch they get the, the ball, ball as much as they do. Not yeah. only do they get the ball, they get hit more than exactly. anybody else because they're getting tackled they're every not, time. They're they running, they're receiving. Moving. Yeah, that's absolutely right. right. Which is why you need two good backs. If you have two good backs. Mm-hmm. You're, mm-hmm. you're pretty set. That's pretty good to have. And a team with two good backs is the Bucks and the Dolphins. They played. Yeah, that was God. A B <laughs> looking like a mole self in that game. He had two yeah. tutties and Brady's number one right now with Gronk oh, out. Easily, I don't think yeah. there's even a question about it. Put Gronk in there, man. I thought sure, like A B yeah. is just his number no, one no guy. Doubt. Who I, I didn't even kind of watch much of it, but who well, was covering him? Do you know? I don't know. Tampa just rolled. Uh, they, they, just, they, they, they dominated is, that whole game. He's pretty much doing matter. anything that he wanted. Yeah. It, that, that, yeah. A really good game. Yeah, Tampa just dominated. Yeah, you guys are definitely right, though. The Buccaneers turned it around completely after I, the I Patriots. Kind of just dominated yeah. 100%. Yeah. Wasn't even close. No. Titans, Jaguars. This game really wasn't even close. 37-19. Which, again, Titans. I was shocked. Yeah, Titans destroyed. Derrick Henry had three tutties. What did you was yeah. Wow. Not nothing. Really? Nothing no. from AJ? So Nowhere to be found. Yeah. Which was, so why did you guys lose to the Jets like that? <laughs> I just don't. It's stuff like this I just don't understand. Well, it's actually insane. Offensively, they did not do anything yeah, really. I know. That's why I said Derrick well, Henry well, had a great game. But yeah, they, I would say they spread the ball around a ton on offense. Nobody had more than three receptions on their team. I guess they had, I mean, really? had yeah. a bad game for the, against the Jets, so they kind of wow. figured stuff out a little bit maybe then. Mm-hmm. But Why? Um, did we want to? Did we mention Seahawks Rams at all? Or no, that was a Thursday night game. right? That was a Thursday game. Yeah, yeah. Rams twenty six. That's the one. Wilson got hurt. Yep. And the Seahawks and then Brissett or um, Geno Smith had a chance to have a game win. And drive, Russell was out there playing for a while with that messed up finger yes, too. And you gotta gross. wonder if Geno came in earlier if they would have won that game, or if Russ did. If Russ wasn't hurt, didn't hurt that finger, they actually might have won that game. Could have. They could have. So do we? Are you thinking the Rams might be maybe not a, as good as you expected them to be? down on yeah. the Rams. <sighs> Dude, Matthew Stafford is out. not looking as hot as he did when the season started. Yeah, people have bad games. I'm like, still good. Wanna, uh, I'm still on the Rams. I still yeah, love the Rams. Maybe they're not super dominating. Uh, they're they're saving it. They're I saving wouldn't. It. After one like, game, I wouldn't say. That. I was gonna say there's. I mean, well, they had a rough game. They had a very rough yeah. game against the Cardinals. Yeah, I'm really I, excited to watch the second matchup of the Cardinals versus the Rams. I am very excited. I don't know what week that is, but I cannot yeah. wait for that. Yeah, honestly. Yeah, no, I still love the Rams. No, so I, 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 still I the agree. Rams. I agree. Yeah. Um, and then the last one, real quick, we're actually recording this as this game is going on. The Buffalo Bills. Yep. Holy moly! I said, dude, if the Bills beat the Chiefs, I'm so in on the Bills, and they. I mean, they oh, man. What, put up a 40 banger. Did they get 40 points yet in that game? Uh, true. Did they get 40 points yet? I cannot. They had 38 it. last night. 38, 38, 30 30 20 final. Yeah, 38 to 20. Which, again, that's a statement victory. That they I said, needed. the thing I see with the Bills, too, they're getting like deep bombs, though, like passes. Yeah. Like those touchdowns, like 40 yard pass, 20 yard yeah. pass, 30 yard pass. Yeah. Like they're just. Into their tight end, too. Like, what the yeah, heck? Yeah, well, who is it? And Knox? Running Dawson back. Knox got yeah. like two super big plays. Yeah. They are playing with so, confidence right yeah, now. Yeah, again, I said, I was like, I just want to see them beat a really good team. And there you go. Yeah, yeah. Wow. And they dominated them like they dominated, dominated the bad teams. That's what I'm saying. So, yeah, I'm very big. Are we really right considering now. the Chiefs a really. We're not considering them a really good team anymore. Oh, are we? What? what are they, two and three? I mean, I'm, I'm saying we're not. Um, They're a good team. They're just. The I don't Chiefs? know. They're falling off a little bit. You think I'm they're asking, a good team? I'm asking. Yeah, no, the, yeah, chi- okay, really the good. Chiefs are a good team. I don't care. I understand three. that. They're a good team. They're you can't really say they're not a good team. I understand they're two and three, but Jesus. Are you yeah, putting them out of your top ten? No. no, I'm asking. I didn't say I'm asking. <laughs> okay, I'm asking you. Are they're not a super good team? <laughs> they're still in the top ten, though. Yeah, yeah, they're not like the dominant workhorse that That's we're used saying. to seeing, obviously. But no, it's just a question. That's all. I didn't mean it for it to get hostile. Like, geez. I thought you were third favorite of... team that you're ripping on. No, 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 <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> yeah, I just feel like it's going to get to a point where people are going to start saying they're the Chiefs. Like, oh, the Chiefs falling off now. Like, I no, they're no. Still they're they're going to make the playoffs, yeah. and then and then they're going to make the Again, playoffs, yeah. and no once team they, is going to want to make them. the playoffs. It's like, you know, when the Patriots, you know, they suck yeah, kind of yeah. a little bit, throughout, and then they get in the playoffs, and they make it look like a freaking What yeah. happened yeah. with the Buccaneers time. last yeah, year? Yeah, they make it look so easy. Yeah. So, just they're the last team anybody in the AFC is going to want to first exactly. in the playoffs in the That's, wild card. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not worried about the Chiefs. No. I don't, I'm just not. Like but your uh, your prediction from the beginning of the season is kind of looking good after that game. I'm kind of hopping on board with the Bills, looking like a Super Bowl team. 
after that performance against the Chiefs, and obviously they steamrolled the teams that they should have steamrolled. I mean, if that's not a confidence boost for beating the Chiefs like that, like that, now you're like, okay, yeah, Bills. I picked the Chiefs okay. to win. Those are road. So did I. Yeah, you did. Yeah. Huh. I thought the Chiefs needed a win like this. Yep. And I thought they like they really needed it. Mm-hmm. And they would go all out for this, and there's none they could do. Yeah. There was yeah. nothing they could I do. See. I want to see who they play next week. I'm Can't stop curious. that offense, dude. Josh Allen is killing it. Josh Allen. I can find who they versed real quick. They versed the Tech. Oh wait, no, they don't. That's a lie. I, I just lied live on air. It's Why so did you just really lied live on air. They play the Steelers at some point later in the season. Oh, um, <laughs> the, oh it's a Bills Titans matchup. Bills Titans. Yeah. Okay. So who knows? Who knows? Well, that was Week Five. A very exciting week. That's true. Very thrilling. A lot of injuries. A lot of missed field goals. I feel like you're definitely starting to see the like teams that are like. Yeah, legit. Like it's coming together. Power. Yeah, mm-hmm. they're starting to figure these teams out. Mm-hmm. I don't oh think, yeah, I think we're past the fluke stage. Now we can really single down on like good and bad teams. We say that, then week six will happen. We'll be like, what yeah. the heck just happened? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Bills get steamrolled <laughs> yeah. by the Titans. I, I'm serious. <laughs> you never know. This season's kind of crazy. Oh man. Uh, well, yeah. stay tuned because week six is next week, and we'll be here next week reporting about week six. So make sure you subscribe, like, and comment down below. I love you. We'll see you in the next love one. Whoa. Uh, Who are you looking at?